A stage dive was probably too much to ask for, but the Dalai Lama was still a big hit at the Glastonbury Festival. The exiled Tibetan spiritual leader made his way to a stage in the Peace Garden, where he was greeted with a rendition of Happy Birthday, ahead of his upcoming 80th birthday next month. He called for love, tolerance and forgiveness in resolving conflicts like Syria and Iraq. If we uh, seriously thinking oneness of humanity, then no basis to kill. I love my own life. Everyone loves their own life. His message was well received by the crowd. Festival of people. Not necessarily a festival of government or politicians. <laughs> it was Lionel Richie who drew the festival's biggest crowd, leading a 100,000 strong karaoke session as festival goers sang along to a string of his hits, including Easy Like Sunday Morning and Dancing on the Ceiling. The event then closed with rock legend The Who performing a greatest hit set on the Pyramid stage, part of a world tour that has been billed as their last. Twitter CEO Dick Costello is out. Jack Dorsey, the co-founder, chairman, and former CEO is back in, at least on a temporary basis. Twitter has been just it's been a mess. crazy <laughs> leadership futility a lot of revolving doors. Now three CEOs are going to be sitting on the board. Yeah, that'll make it hard to hire a new one, to put it uh, lightly. Um, you know, perhaps perhaps Jack will stay. The problem is that, that Twitter, it, it's, it's complicated because of